Welcome to Bonnie Roseman's Fashion Buzz. And this is my 34th segment on Facebook and YouTube. And it's all about my basic rules to dress by. BLT. B, build your wardrobe with classic pieces. L, liven your wardrobe with fun novelty items. And T, tweak your wardrobe with touches of color. And today we're having a bit of a stormy gray day in South Florida, but gray is really a go-to color for me. It's not quite as stark as black and navy. It's just a great neutral and I've always been partial to it. So today I'm featuring gray as my solid basic. And I love that I'm wearing a pair of pleated Italian palazzo pants. I want you to see these. They're just fabulous. And you can roll these up in a ball and they travel incredibly well. And you can dress it up or dress it down. I've worn it with sneakers and I've worn it with high heels. If you were seeing me, I would be showing you it looks great with my Manola Blahniks. Um, but anyway, this is my B, which stands for Bonnie and building your wardrobe with classic pieces. And it's made out of sterling. And I also had them dipped in 22 karat gold and it's an Italian leather braided chain. And I have them in various lengths from 18 down to 36 inches. So you can double it or wear it long or medium length. I have all different lengths. And I have big letters that I do A through Z for people custom. And I also have people that prefer smaller letters. So here's a little difference in the scale. And I can do that in A through Z in gold or silver. So, and then this is a pleated scarf that is almost the same texture as the palazzo pants. So it really works great together. And then we've got the belt. So it's all about basic pieces, unique pieces and touches of color. And I will bring in a little bit of color as we go. But the belt is spectacular. It is a pressed alligator. And then it's actually inserted inside the buckle and the buckle's all hand cast. The straps are handmade. And these are things that come in other colors as well. And of course, I'm wearing gray earrings, which are fantastic. These are not pierced. They appear to be, but they're not. And I have a little silver woven bracelet. And then this beautiful ring that the stones came from Mykonos and it was set in sterling silver. And it's just an unusual piece. So. There you go, from head to toe, I'm into my grays today. And then we can change the whole thing by just taking off the, the letter necklace and that scarf. And I'll put on this incredible vintage David Navarro necklace that's sterling silver with the most incredible hematite and crystal and sterling beads. It really is one of the most exquisite pieces in my collection and something that you would see in the costume division at the Met. Spectacular. And then I have these vintage earrings that I think really pop with this necklace. And that changes the whole look and you don't even have to wear a belt with it. The belt is unnecessary when you're wearing something this dramatic around the neck and I think that looks great. And then you can take this beautiful shawl that's done out of linen, cotton and silk and just put this around your shoulders and you really got yourself a great look. And then I might actually take this since it's so long and just tie it so I don't have to even worry about it slipping or sliding covers my shoulders and it kind of gives me some interest at the waist. And then I have a wonderful purse 
that I've been featuring throughout my shows. So you can see it goes with so many things. But to wear something like that, boy, if this doesn't look like you've just stepped out of Parisian Vogue, I don't know. But this is all mixed, um, painted in gold, silvers, whites, black. On a it's actually an um, Argentinian designer, and she's painted an Hermes-like bag. And it's just, it's just really become one of my favorite pieces. And I have them in a lot of different colors. And she'll do all different types of designs. But I think this is just a great look. If you wanted to dress it up a bit, you can change the whole look by putting on a flower, a flower uh, scarf. In fact, I want to put on a different top completely and show that with the flower scarf. Such fun showing all these different things doing all these quick changes right on, right on air live. This is a wonderful kind of bohemian looking, beautiful silk tunic in grays, blacks, white, silver. It's got these pointed edges on the side. It would be great with a black legging. I have on skinny leggings too which I'm going to show you momentarily because it really does look good. And I wore this little sleeveless turtleneck just to show as a little layering piece underneath these things. But you could be wearing a little camisole. It's a sheer thing, so you probably would want to wear something, a little camisole or a little tank top underneath. But here I am wearing now a pair of leggings in gray, and it just looks adorable. And you can change it up by wearing just a pair of like little sandal shoes and silver. I have, I don't sell shoes, but I try to tell people you can change the look. You can wear it with a little boot if you want to. I mean, it just changes it depending on the shoe you wear too. But this is a great look. And then you can take a scarf like this that's got this great flower pattern and even throw it on with the stripes. I mean, I'm definitely known to, to mix patterns together. And the tones all work. Look at that. Isn't that terrific? And then to take this bag that's got the star and the moon and go like that. All of this works. It's just great. All the tones. Because so the scarf has a little bit of gold in it. There's a little bit of gold here. I might even change the earrings and go with these gold and silver earrings that are just smashing. Like that, I love mixing metals. And there's a little bit of gold in the scarf. It's hard to see it, but it's all here. Here you go, little sparkles of gold leaf at the bottom. So it looks kind of cool with these and people will laugh, but the shoes that I have on I love them so much. I have them in silver and I have them in gold. So sometimes I even take my shoes and I end up mixing them. People think I'm crazy, but I have so much fun mixing and matching. Let's see who's here today. Hi, Harriet. Hi, Lee. Nice to have you, Nancy from the Carolinas. Hi, Al. Great to have you. Jeffrey Fowler, I love you and miss you. I know you're cooking up a storm. Hi, Sandra. I miss you more than you can ever imagine. Hi, Michael from Cheltenham, Pennsylvania. Great to have you. So I'm having fun with this. This is another incredible piece. It's all in the accessories, too. Look at the texture of this piece with this tunic. And then I would take these off and maybe go back to these earrings. I love switching the earrings again. But these just, these are clip-ons, if you can imagine. They just open up like this. What a cool piece. And then just go on the earlobe, like that. And then throw on this necklace with this tunic. I just happen to have a little turtleneck underneath, but you could just, like I said, have a camisole, and then I'm wearing it with the leggings. Adorable. 
And then we can change the whole look by putting on this top, which is a gorgeous silk. It's a little more tailored shape. It still looks pretty with this. But this is a little bit more tailored. It's got black on the back and silver on the front, silver gray on the front. Very tailored, look at this. Black and the gray with little buttons on the side. I mean, it's all in the details. Beautifully made. These are all couture items. One of a kind. Some of these things I can't duplicate, but I can usually have them made to order if you want. Hi, Maddie, great to have you. Hi, Dana, wonderful. Thanks for watching. So, okay, then I'll change the whole look by just taking a jacket like this. It's a shirt jacket. It's got great details on the back, buttons. It's out of a silk shantung. It's three quarter length, three quarter length, like this. And I might go and end up putting on, let's see, right here. This is a gold and silver coil, coil necklace. This is from London. This is a spectacular piece. You see how the gold, I'm trying to show you. It really is like a slinky. Remember the old fashioned slinkies? And you can put that on and then put on the gold and silver earrings again. I'm telling you, and even a gold and silver shoe. It's so fun. Hi Arvo, I miss seeing you on Sundays at Avocado Grill. So there you go. So you can have a gold or silver earring. Let me just put that on a little better. Yeah, that caught it. And you got the necklace. It's got like this little bit of an iridescent quality. I'm wearing the Shantung jacket. Look at the back. And I can do these in any color. And then I might even go the extra mile and take this little kerchief that I had made out of my silicone and silk chiffon in grays, black, silver, gold, and take this and wrap that around the neck. Look at this little piece. You don't have to wear this necklace with it. You could just wear that with the gold and silver earrings. Again, look at the bag with the little gold and silver moon and stars. Here you go. Look at that look. And I can get these made in any size and any color in a silk shantung. It's a great fabric for travel year round. And then a bag like this is really what sets it off with a matching bracelet in a straw. Look at all this. How's that work? And then last but not least, I always like to end with a bang. And I would take this I'm going to show you and wear it with these earrings. So now I have this artist shirt and it's grays, it's white, it has a little bit of a A-line shape to it. It looks great either closed, it's got a placard front so you never see the buttons if you want to wear it closed. But I like it open like a little jacket and then I would wear these little white mother of pearl earrings that have the marcasites to pop the white. And I'd wear that. And if you want to, again, you can cinch in the waist. And I sell belts to my girls that are from size two up to size 16. The belts are made to order. So I can do them in gold or silver in any length strap. And they really give you the appearance if you get it long enough so that the tail goes down to give you a shape, a waistline. You know, even if it's illusional, it's great to give that sense of a waist. And I love this. And I would probably end it with this great hand painted bag, with this hand painted shirt, and then these great mother of pearl earrings. And so that's kind of the show today. And hi, Carol Firth. I don't see you at all, even though you live in my building. Great to have you here. 
Hi, Mary. Love you so much. It was a great song you sang this week, Touch My Soul. And Maria Pardita from Nantucket. You know I'll see you July 1st or 2nd. I can't wait. I miss you so. She's a soul sister of mine. And hi, Bama. I'm not sure if I know who you are, but I'm going to look you up. So thanks so much for watching. This is my 34th show. It's called Bonnie Roseman's Fashion Buzz. And on Fridays, I always do a fashion flashback. This is my picture of when I was the national spokeswoman for Polaroid Corporation in the late 80s. And I did talk shows. Good morning, New York. Good morning, Spokane. Good morning, Hartford. Good morning, Los Angeles. I, good morning, Philadelphia. I can't even think of all. I did like 26 shows, and this was what my publicity picture was like for Polaroid. So anyway, that's a long time ago. Everybody who's putting in a comment, I'm putting it into the bowl. I think I've amassed at least 100 so far. And I will put your name in, and on May 31st, I'm doing a drawing, a $200 gift certificate. Hi, Kathy from Cheltenham High School, one of my alumni. Happy to have you. Anyway, I'll put your names in here. I'm religious about it. And at the end of the month, on the 31st, I will pick a name, and you will get a $200 gift towards anything that I'm showing. And boy, out of 34 shows, I've been getting a lot of calls. My livelihood is now made on individual FaceTime appointments. People are calling me and saying, I want those earrings, I want that shirt, I want that belt. So let me know if there's anything you want to take a second look at. And I'm happy to work with you in your own closet and see what you own and tell you what I think you could keep and actually use maybe something of mine to pop it up a few notches. In the meanwhile, you've brought me so much love and joy in this very challenging time. And I love you all for that. And I'll see you on Monday. And in the meantime, feel good, but look even better. Mwah. See you Monday. Have a great weekend. God bless and stay safe.